walk in the pool. Don't touch it. I said, better not touch it because we're going to put a rose in. that as I'm going around the road we did, I see the way they are. I understand I am the owner. In you could. Raki, in Meke. In Copleca, Bacanela, but that is not true. In this school, oh, oh, not only in Iki school, red roof. In Imeke, Ike is school, red roof. But I make I know you are in process. Oh, Apo, my tenure has ended. My successor was supposed to continue. Now, unfortunately, they did not continue. And that is why, not only here, everywhere. Mr. Agbake at 90%, 80%, 60%. Where it was, didn't see what it, that is where they are. So I want to assure you, okay. even with your determination tonight, not just the number, you can have a number that they take on a corner eye look you. But when I was coming, I saw elderly women. They just got there and I'm like, what have I done to deserve? At this time, many people will be sleeping. This is not a nightclub. But you are waiting for me, me, this poor man. It's a long way. At this age, the only thing that gives me joy, the only thing that gives me joy is that it's to be able to go somewhere and I can see the footprint of my stewardship. That even the children who are under 10, Whatever we do here, in the next 70 years, when they will be 80, they will remember that once upon a time when Oshimbole was governor was where this was done. And I'm going to the city with your support by the special grace of God to deal with the big issues. The big issues. Before I became governor, there was no more factory working. Okwela cement was closed. I got poor. He was begging me. What? I said, no. You either they open the factory or I revoke. Is poor cement not working today? I appeal to my friend. I go there. I say, you support me to be governor. Support me to create jobs. Today, Okwela has two Gaia cement factories. With federal might, we will do even more. Because if we have more factories in this area, if we have more factories, young people will have where to work. There are many people who build houses because they were working as contractors or supply cement or supply sand or granite when they were constructing at the university. The roads they were doing in Afghan land, many people build houses or buy cars where they were doing those roads. If I do those as a governor, with all the opposition from PDP that time, when I say PDP, not the war where they now where your brother don't hear you. When Chikarini was alive, I have to battle them for you to get the development that you have. Today, I don't think the young people are happy who are attending federal universities. Is that a four-year program? You spend six years, and even at that, you are not sure of the quality of the degree. But look at the Edo University a bit. Has it ever gone on strike? No. Clear thinking. Tinubu has assured us in his plan of action, which I have read, that once he's selected, lecturer will not have reasons to go on strike because their salaries will be attractive. We want the best brains back into the universities. Today, those who are intelligent, they don't want to teach. If we are taught by people who are not intelligent, how can our children grow? They say, if the people hasn't learned, it's probably because the teacher hasn't taught well. So, Tinubu, we are sure that the academic calendar is maintained. We must maintain 
the integrity of university academic calendar by paying lecturers what they are entitled to. That you work hard on the farm. There is no government in your life. You are not working for any ministry. You are working on your own, on your farm. Maybe a private company. Or you are selling coconut. Or selling banana. Or selling uh, tomatoes. Or market day, you are looking for to the red market to go and sell uh, orange. Then you make 1,000 or 2,000. You put this money in a bank. Registered by government. This money was designed by government. They didn't consult you, they didn't consult me. They wake up what they are saying, they want to change the color of the money. Yeah. All right? Yeah. The color where the money we had before, don't be we give them the color. Now they do. Uh -huh. She won't change it, change it. Yeah. Now they, they say they have changed it. Where the new one, they don't give. The old one, they collect. Yeah. My friend, yeah. however wicked a man is, you cannot look at your wife and say, this clothes you they wear in Dali, I don't like it. Remove it, I'll give you a new new clothes, new garment. You trust your husband, you remove the clothes. So where is the new one? Say, um, ATM. Ah. The ATM, my man, eh? The ATM house that they live? Okay, no, POS. Where did be POS? I don't even know the meaning as I stand here. And then those who know the meaning, they go there, you want to take 5,000, they say you will pay 1,000. Why should government allow Nigeria to be so exploited? And I want the Mephile. We didn't elect him. We inherited him from PDP as central bank governor. A Mephile talk as if he's of below average intelligence. Because the language he used is so insulting. I watch what when he met with the Castle of State. When they ask him what is the problem, he said they have printed enough money. Uh, it, the problem in the queue in POS and the ATM machine is caused by what he calls miscrants. Our central bank governor is referring to Nigerians as miscrants. He is a miscrant. Yes, yes, Call him a mixed Because anybody who assault you on account of your poverty, he is a poor student of history. I am talking today. They could have called me a miscrant. They could have called my father a miscrant because he has no money. What is the difference between a miscrant and mephile? Who doesn't know the difference between monetary policies and public policy? Have we not changed the color of the Naira before? Yeah. When General Gawa was head of state, many of you were too young. Yeah. To reassert our independence, we were using palms and shillings and pens. He changed it from palms to Naira to show we are now an independent country. Yeah. Every one pound became two Naira. Yeah. Did you see people fighting to get the new money? No. Did you see them fighting to get the new money? No. But that is long history. Because by that time, many of you were not yet born. But this president, President Buhari, when he was military head of change, head of state, he changed the color of the Naira. Nobody complained. <laughs> now call our watch up. When you go to the bank, they give you the new one. They collect the old one. Now we are in a democracy. They now want to change the color. Okay. They say the law said they have the power to do so. All right. You don't like my clothes. You say this. You gave me the cloth. I work for it. I bought it from a legal market, not a bad anger market. <laughs> and then you say I should change it. I say, okay. You will give me new one. I say, all right. I am obedient person. Yes. When I say obedient, I don't mean that. Yeah, yeah, obedient person. Yes. Uh, because tomorrow somebody will say, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> now you remove the cloth. Give me the new one. They say, no, do it. How about? Uh, when are we become slaves on our land? So, 
we have appealed to the president that this policy is damaging, not at the eve of an election. Even INEC need cash, they have to go and pay CBA governor. Have you had where anybody who need money to do business has to go to CBA to pay the governor? And he was arrogantly saying, I will allocate, I will ensure that I allocate enough cash to INEC. Who is he to allocate? Is that the business of central banking? No. That is commercial banking. He has told the bank to Bank of Tomatoes, Bank of uh, Paladiam, Bank of Okro, Bank of everything, and said the monetary policy. Other is what? The Nara has lost its value more than 300 times. When he became the governor of the bank, the Nara was less than 200 to the dollar. Today it is, to what you get is about 700 and something Naira. So these are the big issues. I cannot be in the Senate. I cannot be in the Senate and an institution created by law. What a water. That is any good against one with someone who may share to a level of CPA war. Because when you are hungry, you are angry. And this morning, you slap us. Then why? The person you are slapping is also hungry. That is why I want you to know what is going on. And the big issue is that the country is governed by the rule of law. I will tell you some senators who are my friend. I said the day a Mephile made that decision and he started the law. He started the law that empowered him to change the color of the Naira. Although I don't think changing of the color is the problem. The problem is if you change the color, produce the money. I said to those senators, I said, if I was in this Senate, we will change that law. And the Mephile will become unemployable. Because we can change the law to say, no central bank governor shall be a governor for more than five years. Once we say so, it's gone. We make the law. We are now lawmakers are begging him when he's a product of law I will not go to Senate to beg I will legislate against any evil Amen. and there are many senators who share the same views I'm not going to cry for my country I'm going to fight for my country yes. so those are the big issues appropriation look at the road from here to Benin from Benin to, Abel, to Lokoja Every year they push more money on it. Every year they push more money on it. People are dying on that road. You are not finished one road, you are awarding another contract for another road. Even you, you need to go to school, you want to build three houses. You never roof wall, you don't start the other one. You never need to a little, you start the other one. All three not completed. Does that make sense? Those are the big issues. I want my people to be educated what governance is about. You don't need to read political science to understand that those in government are your tenants. You, the voter, you are the landlords. When they misbehave, you deal with them. Yes, that is what the democracy is about. Even dictators, they build road. What dictators don't do is that they don't consult. What democracy prescribes is that if you are going to make a decision that affects me, you must consult me. How can CPA make a decision? It doesn't consult us. Now the Supreme Court says they should allow your own law to remain valid. Because APC governors went to court to challenge the power of the governor of CPN and even the president to approve a policy that does not, that does not translate to hardship. And the Supreme Court granted interim injunction to restrain the central bank from refusing you to use your own money. Is there any of you with own other note? Yes. Now don't throw it away. Keep it safe. Like Edu I said, this era will remain valid even when a mevile is no longer valid. What did I say? I want to take it slowly. I, I, Adams, Aliu, I, Odeboye, Oshomoli.
today on the soil of Iyuku. Yes. And Iyuku and Iyamo, by the way, we have special relationship. Yes. Historical relationship. Yes. We don't like, we don't, we don't, we don't enjoy each other. Yes. So I am conscious of that history. I want to assure you. This your own Naira note. Forget about the Mephili. They remain valid. Don't change them for a discount. Somebody say, bring the, the old one. What has on? I will give you 600. Tell him he's a madman. Close. That's how it increases the nature of the work. But when it goes on work, it goes weird, less, or suit. The tomorrow they will not be there. What is permanent is the electorate. You have been voters, some of you, not all. Some of you have been voters from the time I was governor in 2007. You are still voters now, but I have ceased to be a governor. Which means. Government will come and go, but the people remain. Yes. So don't feel inferior to anybody. I want to thank you again and again and again. And I will summarize by just saying, vote for APC. Yes. With Tinubu as president, how he managed Lagos State, a state that is the most populated, with all the traffic issues in Oshodi. Some of your children are in Oshodi, are in Lagos. Do you remember what Oshodi used to be? Yes, Now compare that to Anambra, where Peter will be come from. Has Onicha changed? No. If Peter will be eight years, could not change Onicha. I changed Bini in eight years. Did that not? Have you the mother of Peter in Bini? Did that not? Have you the mother university in Edono? Did that not? Of course, I've built many roads. Akwe Kwe. EPA. And the better. You can do it. Ask OP or you go to Anambra and look for any hospital as beautiful as the one I built in Benin. So if you cannot manage Anambra, a Bakasi boy took over Anambra when he was governor. How can he come and say he wants to manage Nigeria? If you can't manage your house, you can't manage the community.